Hey guys, Genius Pie Trap here, and I want to show you guys enhanced steam. Just not normal steam, but enhanced steam. And what this is, is it works in your browser. If you go, I'll leave a uh, description and link, but it's uh, www.enhancedsteam.com. And there's a download. Now you do need Chrome or Firefox, or even Opera Works. But, uh, you know, Chrome and Firefox works great. Here's a download, I'll leave a link in the description. Now this works with when you go to www.steampower.com. So when you're viewing Steam in your browser, not when you're viewing Steam in your executable. And you know here I have it in my executable. Here it's uh, in the browser. So I'll just show you some differences here that uh, Enhanced Steam gives you. Um, for one thing, if you look through the games, you know games will pop up, and you know it'll just show a list of games like so, and you know, show you deals and such, and there's really no way of telling if you own the game, you know, or or not. Now, enhanced Steam, it'll show the same list here. Let's go to top sellers, and as you can see here, Fallout 3 is it's uh, highlighted in green here. So is Sleeping Dogs, and what that means is Payday 2 highlighted in green. What that means is I already own them. So enhanced Steam automatically highlights green the games you already own. Now, if you notice here, again, today's deal, Poker Night 2, it's, a, it's in green. I already own that. If I go back to the normal Steam, you know, again, no highlighted green. So it's just a nice way to, you know, highlight some games you already own so you can kind of ignore them while you're browsing through the store. Um, also, in Enhanced Steam, if you notice, uh, let's look here. Here we go, Enhanced Steam. Rogue Legacy. This is highlighted in blue. That means that it's on my wish list. So if I add a game to my list, wish list and it pops up here, it'll be in blue. I get Saints Row the Fourth. It's on my wish list, highlighted in blue. Just a neat little feature. Um, other features that we got, if uh, let's say go here, there's a good way to show if you look at bundles. So we'll go here, it shows the bundles. We'll go back to our executable. Normal Steam here. Click on the same bundle. Now here again, it lists all the games, the price for them. You know, no indication whether I own it or it's on my w wish list. And then down here you can say price of individual games, $293. The bundle costs $89 and how much you save. Now. You know, the normal Steam figures this as it takes the, the price of the bundle minus the cost of the real games. But it doesn't account for that all these games are on sale already. So if I go to Enhanced Steam, same now here I go through the same thing. Notice that it's got green, like Dishonored. I already own Dishonored. It's highlighted in green. So this is a great way to, you know, I already own a bunch of these games on this bundle. And if I go down here, it's different because... 99 actually only one thing you're saving by buying the bundle is $99.49 because this counts for the games that's actually on sale. It takes the sale price of it and then how much you're actually saving by buying the bundle. Just a nice neat little feature. Now, if we also go, there's a nice way to view how the price of an actual game and the uh, price that it's taking. Now, if we go to Sleeping Dogs here for example, um, and the executable. Now this doesn't show an enhanced steam. Enhanced steam will just show you price, or a normal steam will just show you in price. And enhanced steam, there's little pop-ups right here, and it tells the lowest price ever on steam, or the lowest price is six dollars and twenty-four on steam. That's not even if it's not sold on steam. The historical low was six dollars and twenty-four cents. Let me see if I can find you guys another example here. Uh, here, let's go Borderlands two once. See what that says. Um, the lowest price for lowest price right now on Borderlands 2 is twenty nine dollars and ninety five cents at Gamers Gate. So it even shows you the low price. You know, it's five cents cheaper than it is on Steam right now, and the historical low, the lowest it's ever been, is seven dollars and forty nine cents at Git Games. So it's just a neat little thing that uh, you know. Obviously, you know, it's showing you that. Uh, you know, why spend $29.99 when it's already been on sale for $7.50 and I'm sure it's going to be that uh, that uh, cheap again. 
Um, one more scary feature, I guess, is how much you spent on Steam. Now, if you haven't spent a lot on Steam, that's maybe not too much. But uh, if you go to right here where it says, now this is on hand Steam again. Click down and you go to account details. Uh, a number shows up of how much you've actually spent on Steam. And it gives you a dollar amount. And I won't show you guys what the dollar amount is that I spent on Steam. But uh, I think I have like 550 games. So, um if you guys want to take a guess, that'd be great. If you guys, could, if someone could guess it right, I'll gift them something out of my inventory. But uh, anyway, that's Enhanced Steam. If you guys got any questions about Enhanced Steam or anything about Steam or any other games, uh, feel free to message me, like, and subscribe my videos. Talk to you guys later. Bye.